name is Majid, Julia grad, downbeat rising jazz violinist, educator, composer, and today we're going to be talking about the detaché stroke. The detaché stroke is one of the most fundamental strokes on the violin. It's used pretty much in every piece of music that is ever been written on the violin. It has been described by Leopold Auer as a stroke that is used from the tip to the frog with a totally even bow pressure. In order to get an even detaché stroke, we have to first understand the weight of the bow. As you can see, from the tip to the frog, the bow has a weight to it that's gonna be heavier on the frog side because of the added weight. Which means that when I start to do my detaché stroke, when I look to achieve an even stroke, I'm gonna have to keep in mind that the frog here is gonna be a little heavier and the tip is gonna be a little lighter. Now, when I start to achieve my detaché stroke, I need to also make sure that my bow is at the proper sounding point, which is exactly right in the middle. So I line it up. I'm making sure that when I go to the tip that I apply a little bit more pressure with my finger so that I can actually have an even stroke. Here's it, a detaché stroke on the A string. practice my detaché stroke on a piece called the Kreutzer Etude Number no. 1. And it sounds like this. Making sure that I'm applying even pressure across the strings as I go through the stroke, from the top to the bottom. That day's hache did come in handy right there. And there you have it. Stringing through the basics, detaché stroke. Please like, subscribe, and turn on your notifications. See you next time.